Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Smash Cast, Super Smash Brothers Brawl. Um, moving on into a, another battle that I had um, with every, basically had to incorporate the team over. Um, this is me versus Brambles. Bramble, Brambles, I actually do not know if he prefers plural or not. So, our starter. Okay, last episode, um, I did say um, there may have been one or two other times that we played Battlefield instead of Smashville for our starter. This would be the time that we played uh, Battlefield. <laughs> and actually, Bramble suggested that we start on Battlefield, so <laughs> I, I um, didn't say so. I said, um, we'll wait, and we just ended up going to Battlefield. So, striking. Now, Lucario. Huh. Well, I think I've already mentioned his aura in my Casual Friday video. And this is actually, like, I just figured I feel comfortable with Lucario. He used to be, like, one of my big, my big, like, mains. I mean, like, back when we played casually. And even, like, um, when we um, played, like, started getting competitive, he was one of my better characters. I think it's just because he's easy. Like, He's like medium weight, like he's not light, so he doesn't die early. But um but he's not heavy either, so he can take he can um stand up to um high percents of damage and that just makes him stronger. And it's been about like 30 seconds into the match and I haven't even gotten damage. So that just shows how much I want to charge my aura. I mean at times I like if it's like first few lives, I will take a couple of hits on purpose, just to charge more a little bit. Well, now Bramble is in here. Now Lucario, his counter, his down B is um, double team, isn't necessarily the best counter in the world. It's well, it's definitely better than Peach. Um, her counter, but I'd say, um, um, probably the best counter is probably Marth's. Uh, mainly just because Lucario's is, like, just the way it hits is just not too good. I, it, you could see that last time I missed. <laughs> it do, I missed. Well, oh, I sweet spot the ledge. In this game, it's real easy. I'd go for a back throw to an aura sphere, to an up smash, which I'm curious how long I did. But I got the forward smash, so I'm happy. Happy, happy, happy. Now I figure he's just going to be trying to hit me with the arrow, so I just gotta jump up. Get him with an uncharged aura. Another slightly charged aura. Charging up Aura. And the medium Aura just got defeated by an arrow. What's up with that? That's just. Like, the arrow should split the medium Aura into smaller Aura. Power shielding. And getting scared for a double team and get KO'd. Now, I've got invincibility fans, buddy. So just kind of dodging attacks and going throws. Now, um. At higher percents, when both of us are at higher percents, so when my hour was charged too, I like going in for some pummels and then forward throw so I can get um, them near the right ledge. Because if I um, do extreme speed down and I just tilt the control stick down, I'll immediately go, I'll automatically go right. So, and then I'll sweet spot the ledge too. So, that's good edge guarding. Uh, fall through the platform and do a couple dares. Actually, I think that's one dare. I just think it's two because it hits twice. <laughs> Get scared again for another double team. Now, um, one combo I seem to be able to do on low percentage is oh gosh, down throw. It's either fair or up air. I think it. I don't know. And I was recently playing um. PM Lucario, and I think it works for him too. 
Actually, no, um, a down throw to, like, um, you jump and then do a couple bears or something. Something like that. I don't know. Maybe I'll show off on the on Macario next week. We go both get a miss grab, and I just kind of scoot down to the stage. Going in for some horse palms. Don't exactly know why I'm doing that either. Well, <laughs> most of my sma Smash play is just winging it. I mean, like, a lot of the times if I'm doing something familiar, I have a motive. But a lot of the times if I don't know what to do, I'm just winging it. I mean, you guys see me play Falco. <laughs> yep, nobody laughed at that joke. Well, too bad. I made it anyway, it was a bad pun. And that's all I need to do to be on to be a good gamer on YouTube is uh, bad puns and uh, games. Yeah, that's that's like all you need. That and love. Well, actually, you don't need that. That's uh, just me trying to make a Beatles reference. Anybody who got that, that there, that would be that's cool. On to the match. I uh, miss a <laughs> Aura Sphere. And this is looking pretty good for me. I mean, when, even if I get um, damaged a bit, it's still, like, um... Because he's at 117, and I can do some pretty um, good things with um, percents. Like, if I have good percent. Uh, but I don't need it. I do a um, d down tilted um, extreme speed for an edge guard. And Edgeguard is in this game. It's just not as effective as it was in Melee. Melee or PF. Decided to switch over to... Now, am I saying... I think I'm saying Zelda because I just figure it's a better character. In this case, like, because I figure he'll stay Link. But no, he goes um, Meta Knight. Or does he? Um, oh, yeah, that's right, he's Pikachu. And we go to Halberd. I remember now. Now, see, even then, it's good to stay on um, Zelda, because, um, Nairu's Love, her bead, you know, blue hitbox field, um, actually reflects, um, it's a reflector, too. It's just not as good as, say, the shines from Spacey. You know what I like about, like, um, say, Olimar's Nair is just, so get people off me, that's kind of what, um, Nairu's Love does, because, um, gosh, Zelda's, um, Nair isn't as good for that, then why are we pausing? Um, oh, that's right, um, Bramble asked for a rematch, like, literally he asked, like, can we start the match over, but, you know, no, we cannot start the match over. Especially since we are 12 minutes in, and I kind of like to keep these like under 20 minutes. So. Well, I mean, I guess it wouldn't take much time, but still. It's the principle of the thing. You can't restart. Anyway, so I realized that my up air, one of my strongest and one of my best kill moves, cannot reach the upper platform. How delightful. And we're reaching to the part of the stage where we get to the halberd. Now I don't know if I've shown this battle, these um, the these um, this stage on screen. It's um, it's really good for Meta Knight. I mean, yeah, literally he gets home he gets home hometown home field advantage. Well, I guess it's kind of hometown, you know, the town of space and the halberd ship, but. Um, but yeah, he can like shark, which is like using his up air through the bottom platform. Oh, and I get a good ferret. That's like not often in brawl. Like it's easier to. I think it's easier to do it in PM, but it's like hard, really hard to do in a brawl. And me planking kills me. Now, one thing about um, Bramble. Um, Bramble's Pikachu is he spams Thunder. He spams a lot out of Thunder. 
that and mostly his... I think he uses Thunder... like, three moves he uses. Thunder Jolt, which is his neutral B, Thunder, which is his down B, and Forward Smash. With some occasional down smashes thrown in. And could have gotten him up there, I think. And that may have actually... No, that one killed him. He's only at 42. <laughs> Quick! Well, Zelda's looking away. Nope. And could have gone into, like, a dense fire. And that would have worked. And Mr. Dense Fire again. And somehow I'm better at aiming these dense fires than the Project Dumb ones. <laughs> oh, he's trying to take me with him. That's... That's adorable. He thinks I'll actually get hit by that. No. I think that's one of the same reasons why the stage doesn't seem much in competitive play. I mean, I think it, it's... I'm pretty sure it's legal. And either way, I mean, I think it's legal enough. Like... Uh, um, I think it's just because of, like, the interference of the lasers and the claw and the bomb. Like, the random spherical bomb thing. Like, comes in every once in a while. But, nope, we're back on the road again. Actually, we're in the sky, but I don't care. And... Nope, it's not going to be another up smash finish. Get inspired? I think that would be considered sharking right there. It's just not really much of sharking. Forward smash, miss. Forward smash, miss. Get inspired, hit. And... There's the up smash. I'm not sure how, when, what percentage it takes to kill that, because usually when I'm trying to use it, it's they're already at kill percentage. Well, I guess that's going to be it for this episode. And look at that! We got play 50 hours of brawls! Play 50 hours of brawls? Yeah. Well, I guess that's it. See you guys.